Yo guys, today we'll be talking about the Sonic 2 trailer. So this is the the making, of course, a sequel to Sonic. And guess what? The trailer was so amazing. Okay. The trailer was so amazing. It was. They well let's talk about all of the positives. There's there is really no negatives in the trailer. I know there's gonna be someone's gonna find negatives, but they are really key. they are really out trying to improve on the first movie. The first movie was already pretty amazing. It was if you like Sonic, you'd like the movie. But they're doing this, keeping it true to the source material. Cause in the second Sonic game, Tails was introduced. The second movie, he's being introduced, but they're introducing Knuckles in the Master Emerald in this movie as well. And Knuckles' design is pretty great in the movie, and his voice acting is pretty good. Is per is pretty good for him, and also they had brought back the the actual voice actor for Tails to be in this movie. So yeah, and also Tails has his plane in the movie as well, which is pretty good. Also on the t poster they have a callback to the or actual older designs of Sonic robots, which is pretty good. They are. Making this, they're now turning this into the games in the movies. Of course, they're keeping the original human characters in the movie from the first movie in the games, of course, because they're introduced as... They're, the human bear characters in this Sonic movie are way better than the human characters in Sonic 06. Okay, but I'll be talking about what they could do in Sonic 3 and why this movie... You know, because they're always gonna, if this movie is a massive success, and why might be more successful than the Mario movie, wouldn't be surprised at all. Oh, because my because no people don't really don't know if the, if the Mario movie be good or bad, but everybody is excited for this movie. Unlike when the first movie's trailer came out, we had that horrendous design for Sonic. We had that horrible, ugly thing for Sonic. Nick and they have all of the things, and then we have to talk about Eggman's design. Doctor Robotnik has Eggman's design. He is basically, with the exception of him being, like, more chunky, he is basically Dr. Eggman as Jim Carrey, which, you know, was already pretty great. Jim Carrey was the best character of the first movie because Jim Carrey finally brought the, no, his, not the, his funny humor back. And it, I, I can't wait for more Jim Carrey jokes in this movie. And... That Tails and Knuckles is induced. We don't know if there's any more characters because again, they might be keeping another character or two secret that we might not know, like another villain for Doctor Eggman. But I think in Sonic Free, since they have the Master Emerald, I think in Sonic Free they're going to introduce the Chaos Emeralds. Metal Sonic will probably be in its shadow. The Hedgehog, as well, will probably be in the movie as well. I think those are my major predictions for the third movie. They're going to have the Chaos Emerald, Super Sonic, Metal Sonic as one of the villains that Dr. Eggman creates. Also, you have the Dr. Eggman Space Empire now, like in the actual game. So, Dr. Eggman has all those space things as well. But yeah, yeah, Metal, you, you might have, you, again, Metal Sonic will probably be in the next one. They'll probably introduce more of Sonic's friends. They'll probably introduce Saudi Hedgehog as well. Which I think that introducing Saudi Hazog and Master Emeralds and Metal Sonic and maybe Chaos would be a good idea. I think keeping it sticking it to Saudi Hedgehog and that being introduced and Sonic being framed for stuff that Saudi Hedgehog did, like Sonic Adventure as well. You know, Sonic Adventure 2, you know, so Sonic was framed for stuff that Saudi Hedgehog has done because they were alike. And, you know, not the only game that did that. Mario Sunshine did it afterwards. They did the same exact plot line. But, you know, it makes a lot of sense that, you know, Sally has to be in the next movie as well. And Sonic Frontiers was revealed as well. Sonic Frontiers coming on PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Series X, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch. So, yeah, Sonic movie... Too, so there, there was, they really just announced this. Okay, that was like one of the basic questions is, will there be a Sonic movie too? But yep, Sonic e. Hedgehog 2 is essentially going to be most likely better than the first movie. And 
this is I, the funny thing in the Sonic movies I, right now. I was kind of I was better than the games. This is the most funniest thing because Sonic Forces was not a bad game, but it could have been a better game. Okay, you know. As well, I'm not I'm not asking for Sonic Forces to be events of free or something like that, but Sonic Forces could have been a better game. Okay, Sonic the Hedgehog free. I think they should introduce Sonic the Hedgehog, Metal Sonic as well. You know, many more, many of the other characters like. Rogue the Bat, as well, many other characters in the Sonic universe, and maybe introduce Amy Rose as well, which is introduced in Sonic CD as well. And what could they do with a sports movie? I think they could, they said this ended off for the trilogy, but you know, they might, you know, they have, we have more Sonic villains, we have like Infinite from Sonic Forces. I know a lot of people dread that name, but we also have the villain from Sonic Saturday Hedgehog as well, you know. Chaos could be a villain in the Dark Four Sonic movie, you know, created by Dr. Eggman, and then they becomes perfect chaos, and Sonic has to be Super Sonic to be him. There's also a lot of, like, other villains, like the Solaris, as well, and many other villains in the Sonic series. And I think, you know, Super Sonic would be a good idea as well, because, again, Sonic is a CGI kill. They don't really need to... Have him flying throughout like in like Marvel and stuff. You have, you know, ropes and stuff. Because that's what they do behind the scenes and stuff. So you don't, like, hurt themselves or something like that. But, yep, Sonic, he had, like, two trailer. It looked amazing. The trailer is on Paramount, I think. Paramount's channel and other channels will probably, like, IG and probably so we pick up as well. So, yeah. And, yeah. That's basically it about this video. Goodbye.